Knowledge of how the mind works and research into body language has shown how certain persuasion techniques are more effective than others. This course, which explains the art of persuasion, presents theories and techniques which have been proven, tested and even backed up by science. Some people might ask if it is ethical to use such persuasion techniques since they could be confused with manipulation. Any technique, whether it applies to business or personal relationships, is neither good nor bad by itself, but rather depends on the intentions of the person who adopts it. For example, an explosive has enormous destructive power. If this is used to destroy a run-down, dilapidated building in order to build a newer, better one, then this is positive. If, however, it is used to sink a boat, then the effect is negative. In the same way, if you choose kindness and a listening attitude towards others with the intention of getting to know them and helping them, then this is positive. If, however, your objective is to uncover their weaknesses in order to manipulate them or cause them harm, then the outcome is negative. Every persuasion technique depends on how it is used, since each can be used in a positive or a negative way. In this course, we're going to explore these different techniques, presuming that our intentions are always positive, always bringing out the best in others and holding no hidden objectives. It's very important to use these techniques in a business context, since they can help people, teams and organisations to work together in order to achieve a common objective in the fastest and most effective way possible, whilst maintaining a consistent, and a balanced approach. Always explain clearly the intentions behind your behaviour and be transparent in how you choose to persuade others. People tend to be extremely adept at detecting dishonest intentions. If you are not dishonest, but instead show integrity, you will have a positive influence on others. Remember, you are always influencing others whether you want to or not. This course will help you to be proactive and efficient, showing you which emotional and relational aspects you have to be aware of when you want to be persuasive. Use these techniques responsibly and with integrity and honesty. By doing this, you will become a better person, employee, manager and a leader.